Hi everyone, uh, welcome to another Go Mojo Go video. It's been <laughs> quite a while since I've last posted anything. Uh, yeah, haven't really been doing much other than playing GT7 offline. Um, and I'm really enjoying it. I know it's been getting a lot of uh, hate out there because of the lobbies situation. Um, it hasn't really bothered me that much. I've done a few online races, that's all cool. But I'm enjoying the, uh, the solo play uh, of the games. Um, just mucking around with different cars and setups and whatnot. So I'm really enjoying the game so far. But what I want to show you today is what we're going to do actually is my very first engine swap. Um, I've going, got a RX-7, I'll uh, oh, just fire it up here. Got a uh, RX-7 Spirit R Type A from 2002 wearing a Bathurst winning livery by someone I can't remember the name of. I'll post his name in the description below if you want to look it up. But yeah, I uh, won an engine for this RX-7, uh, an 787B engine, which I'm going to insert in this thing just to see how crazy that is going to turn out. But first of all, <clears throat> I'm just going to run this car in stock settings. I've got racing soft. I figure I'm going to need that once I get the 787B engine in here. <clears throat> and uh, everything else, as you can see, is purely stock. I've even labeled the, uh, <laughs> I've even labeled this as stock, so you know. Nothing's been changed, no additions whatsoever, no weight reductions, anything like that. Um, I'm going to do a few laps around Sakuba, uh, and then we're going to do this engine swap, uh, and then uh, just see how insane this car is going to be uh, once that's done. Actually, before we do a lap, I'll show you where uh, you can tune. So if you're lucky enough to win an, an engine uh, in the... Uh, Wheel of Misfortune, you'll end up <laughs> in this, uh, sitting in your tuning parts area and as you can see I've got the RX-7 selected and it can, you can see straight away I've got two engines that are compatible. This is the standard RX-7 engine um, just to replace it if I uh, make some modifications and decide to restart uh, with a clean engine. This is just the regular RX-7 engine which I'm not going to do right now. What I'm interested in is in the 787B engine. And if I were to install it now, which I'm going to do that shortly, look at this. Um, look at the horsepower, jumps from 292 brake horsepower to 690. Wow. Max torque doubles, pretty much doubles from 33.9 to 62. And look at that power to the weight to power uh, ratio 4.27 to 1.84. <laughs> this thing is going to be absolutely crazy once we get installed. Not going to do it just yet. I want to do a few laps at Sakuba uh, just to see what sort of lap times I can get. And then we'll install it and uh, have some fun in the new engine. So uh, let's get right in there. All right, here we are. We're just going to do a few laps. Don't expect any amazing times. I'm very uh, slow. I'm average at best. So don't at me if, with a... Uh, complaints about how slow I am. I know I am. I'm just going to do a few laps. See how as good as I can get in this car as it is. Whoops, let's drop it down. And uh, once I get a decent lap, I'll just do a couple, two or three laps, uh, and then we'll do the engine swap. So I'll be, let me just get this sorted, and I'll be back shortly. Oh, <laughs> oh, that's a good way to end the hop lapping. I'm not going to get any better than that right now. One minute point six uh, for the time being. So let's just cross the line here. And uh, yeah, so uh, let's go over and um, check out what this thing sounds like and performs once we uh, swap over to the new engine. So uh, we'll be right back. All right, here we are. Let's go in there. Let's do my very first engine swap. Um, this is exciting. <laughs> I can't wait to see what this is going to be like. So let's go into the tuning's menu. Tuning menu, I should say. Pick the 787B. Let's install the beast. Uh, and recommend a retail value of a million dollars. And why not? It is a 787B after all. Absolute legend of a vehicle. Okay, yes done it's installed we've gone from three to two 
um, let's go back into the settings now got racing soft as you can see still all stock except now I've got as you can see on the left hand side engine model R26B 787B and everything else remains stock so let's get back to scuba and see what this car is really capable of oh this is exciting all right here we are and in the background i hear what sounds like a 787b running in the background hang on let's oh, okay so this is gonna be cool all right let's jump in there see what it's like <laughs> and listen to the roar wow this is crazy oh oh okay she's got a lot of power i might actually have to turn on traction control there because this is a lot of horsepower and off to brake i have to brake a lot earlier than i'm used to all right oh this is insane Break a bit early. Oh. Change up a little early just so I don't spin the wheels. Oh. I'm lifting a little bit because, oh god, this thing is mental. <laughs> wow. Okay. Man, she's very flighty with this big thing sitting in her. Let's try and break in a straight line. Bit of a slide action. <laughs> oh, well this is crazy. Let's see if we can put in a half decent lap. There we are, we're already five seconds up. Whoop. Easy on the throttle. Oh man, this is amazing. I love it. Oh, no, break too late. Oh man, there goes that lap. Oh, listen to that little rumble. Nice. All right, let's see if we can put in one decent lap. Alright, here we go. This is it. I'm going to break the record. Or oh, my record, anyway. Oh, gee. Now, I think with the 787 in this thing, tuning is required to tame her a bit, I'd say. Oh, the brakes. I need better brakes on this thing. She's very twitchy, twitchy girl. I'm being very gentle around here. Oh. I'm trying to break a little earlier this time. Yes, hear the roar. Let's see if I can keep it planted now break early oh man so wants to spin I think anyone who's good at tuning will probably be able to tame this car uh, which I'm not good at tuning so it ain't gonna be me but man this is so fun whoa oh holy moly Wow, well, just totally lost the rear end. Anyway, this is just a quick look uh, to see what it's like. If you haven't swapped an engine yet, then this combo is <laughs> a lot of fun. Highly recommend it. Oh man, it's such a crazy car to drive now. It's like Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, where uh, they are driving Mr. Hyde right now. 
Oh man, it's so much fun. Oh, break a bit early. Ooh. So what's to lose the re rear end? Alright, I'm gonna do one more lap. See if I can beat my time. Oh no, I'm not gonna do one more lap. That was rubbish. Anyway, <laughs> that's good fun. I think you've seen all you need to see. If you've got an engine swap, I highly recommend you do it. Uh, upgrade any car that you find compatible with that motor. Do it. I'm sure it's going to be a blast once you get it done. Anyway, I'm going to keep on playing. Hope you enjoy this video. Uh, let me know what you think uh, in the comments. And yeah, I'll uh, catch you guys next time. Take it easy.